What's happening there guys and welcome back to another great video on our channel. In today's video, we're going to take a look at how Joseph Quinn and Metallica fulfilled Eddie Munson's dream. Stay tuned to find out what this is all about. Eddie Munson's performance in Stranger Things. If you've seen season 4 of Stranger Things, then we don't need to remind you about Eddie Munson's iconic performance in the end. When we talk about going out with a bang, there's no better example than Eddie Munson's character. In the last episode, where the Stranger Things' gang takes on their mission to defeat Vecna once and for all, Eddie Munson and Dustin Henderson take over the role of distracting the bat, while Steve, Nancy, and Robin go in a face-to-face -face battle with Vecna. While distracting the bat and luring them away from the house where Vecna resides, Eddie Munson stands on top of a trailer and gives the most iconic metal performance that we've seen in a while. Eddie Munson, played by Joseph Quinn, performs Metallica's guitar solo for Master of Puppets. The scene has the most captivating performance, where Eddie is seen giving his 100% to the performance, doing absolute justice to the work of Metallica. At the end of the performance, Dustin tells Eddie that it was the most metal he has ever heard, and we can't help but agree with Dustin on this. But giving a performance that epic means that Eddie definitely has some obsession with Metallica, and it was probably his love for the band that made him give the most epic guitar solo we've ever seen. Before we get into the details of how Metallica and Joseph Quinn fulfilled Eddie Munson's dream, make sure you like this video and subscribe to our channel if you want more such content in the future. Eddie Munson meets Metallica Eddie Munson, played by Joseph Quinn, is no doubt a huge fan of Metallica, and considering his performance of the Master of Puppets, there is no doubt that no one deserves to meet Metallica more than Eddie Munson himself. Well, it seems like Eddie Munson finally got his dream come true after he finally got the chance to meet Metallica at the backstage of their Lollapalooza concert. The meeting between Eddie Munson and Metallica is probably one of the most wholesome things we've ever seen. It starts off with Eddie asking the members of the band if they're a fan of Stranger Things, upon which he receives the response that they've been a fan of the show since Season 1. James Hetfield, whose guitar solo that Eddie Munson had tried to replicate, says that he's been watching the show since Season 1 with his kids. Eddie responds by thanking the band for letting him use their track on the show, upon which James Hetfield thanks Eddie for doing justice to the track. Imagine getting approval from the James Hetfield himself. Gifting Eddie a guitar As of getting approval from a band that you've been obsessed with isn't enough, Eddie Munson was then invited by Metallica to practice with them in their tuning room. As per usual, Eddie does a stunning job at doing the guitar solo while other members of the band take their own places. At the end of the practice, the band says that Metallica now has five members instead of four, and the entire time, Eddie Munson can be seen turning red with happiness. But this isn't where things come to an end for Eddie Munson. While the character may have succumbed to a terrible death at the hand of bats in the show, in real life, it seems like Eddie Munson seems to be getting everything he has dreamt of. After the practice session is over, the band then further surprises Eddie with a guitar, which happens to be the very same guitar with which Eddie Munson performed his solo on Stranger Things. The red metal guitar is the perfect ode to Eddie's epic performance, and to make things even better, each member of the band signs the guitar before giving it to Eddie Munson. Eddie gets down on his knees after seeing the guitar because he can't fully wrap his head around everything that's happening and we can't even imagine what he must have felt like in the moment. Homage to Eddie Munson Imagine being one of the greatest metal bands to have ever existed. Well, in the case of Metallica, they're probably one of the most popular and greatest metal bands in the history of music alongside ACDC. After Eddie Munson's performance of Metallica's Master of Puppets and Stranger Things went viral and caught the attention of Metallica, the band members decided to pay homage to Eddie Munson's character by releasing their own version of a duet with Eddie Munson. Moreover, the band members also wore t-shirts of the Hellfire Club, a club owned by Eddie Munson and Stranger Things. The video released by the band shows Eddie Munson's performance on the side while the band members recreate the scene. At their concert in Lollapalooza, Metallica even played the scene on the side while performing Master of Puppets, a dream come true. Meeting Metallica and having the time of his life was a dream come true for Joseph Quinn's character Eddie Munson. Ever since Eddie made his debut on the Stranger Things show, 
He has made a place in the hearts of people who are metal fans, and it seems like he's also made a permanent place in Metallica's hearts as well, and has caused a huge impact on the band, causing the sales of their Masters of Puppets records to go up by 47%. And here's everything you need to know about how Joseph Quinn and Metallica fulfilled Eddie Munson's dream. So how do you feel about this gesture by Joseph Quinn and Metallica? Do let us know in the comments down below, and do be sure to like the video and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you again later.